It was life and death. Either you live or you die. Which one do you want, Tom? That was the decision. In the corporate life and in the gym. But if you want something bad enough, if you want something bad enough, you can't let anybody tell you you can't do something. I'll repeat that. If you want something bad enough, you can't let anybody tell you you can't do something, not even yourself. People doubted me. I doubted myself sometimes, too. To do anything successfully in life, you've got to want it as bad as you want to breathe. We're running at 40%, most of us. You know, because we're half in and half out. And it's not surprising, because life is difficult. It's like, well, what if you were 90% in, or 95% in, or, or all in? Because you're all in anyways, right? It's a, it's a life and death game. No one gets out of this. Everyone dies. You might as well commit yourself. And you might as well commit yourself to the highest good that you can attain, because why not? It'll imbue your life with meaning. It's hard, the responsibility is there, but all the meaning's in the responsibility. And when you get to the point where all you want to do is be successful, as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. And I'm here to tell you, number one, that most of you say you want to be successful, but you don't want it bad, you just kind of want it. You don't want it bad and then you want to party. You don't want it as much as you want to be cool. You, most of you don't want success as much as you want to sleep. If you're going to be successful, you've got to be willing to give up sleep.